this summer, Benelli takes you behind the scenes of Duck Commander Company and invites you to meet the Robertsons, the first family of duck hunting. <laughs> Bill Robertson. If I could not hunt, the only thing that would be left, I guess, would be to die. For 30 years, Bill Robertson's life has been dedicated to the relentless pursuit of ducks. I'd fool around with trying to make a better duck call more duck-like. He pioneered the modern duck call, broke new ground in hunting videos, and redefined the hardcore duck hunter. Hidden away in the Louisiana backwater, the Duckmen have remained elusive and mysterious for three decades. Now, for the first time on national television, see the men behind the legend, Willie Robertson. The boss hog, CEO of Duck Commander Company. I'm the brains of the operation, so to speak. You ain't gonna make it. You just watch the back. Whoa! Moron, you hit my mailbox. Jace Robertson. When I graduated from high school, it was the most frogs I've ever caught in one night, because I didn't go to graduation. Some days I'm just in the zone. On my duck call building, those would be my best duck calls. John Godwin. I'm one of the duckmen. I'm also the go-to guy, the decoy tech. You know, I'm pretty protective over my decoys. I handle them with kid gloves. <laughs> Cy Robertson. Mama named me after her. My middle name is Mary. I was the meanest thing in football pads for 130 pounds. Oh, Growing up, I realized I had an identity crisis. Benelli brings you into the blind. At home. It's a tie! And on the road with the Robertsons as they hunt through the season while staking their claim as the world's greatest duck hunters. Get ready for an exclusive look into the business, the blinds, and the minds that comprise Duck Commander. It's not a, a sport with us, it's a way of life. Brought to you by Benelli, this summer on the Outdoor Channel. <laughs>